In an extremely chance time voice. Stream time! Alright, hello, indeed. It's time for stream. Gonna be more Dr. Slump tonight. Last week, uh, the first session of this game, Arale was born because she is a tiny robot child with unlimited energy. Which, is explain which explains why she can be born and then immediately just be destruction incarnate. <laughs> Not a poorly meaning one, but, you know, Ar Arale is just completely immortal, cannot be stopped by any force on this Earth or any other, can't be stopped by Goku, for example. That's very important to remember. Go Goku can't stop her. Stronger than Goku. Confirmed. Uh, so, yeah, basically, we've just started and explored a bit, got a whole lot of abilities, went back in time once to the prehistoric era because Senbei is, you know, not, not the most active parent, you could say. You know, he he kind of just lets Raleigh do whatever. <laughs> just lets her go to the past and fight a dinosaur. You look, some kids need this, okay? It's fine for some kids. But regardless, uh, in addition, there's also an evil scientist whose name escapes me right now. I'm just going to refer to him in the meantime as Dr. Wily if he were an Atlas protagonist, I guess. Or not protagonist character. Completely different. Definitely not a protagonist. Well, I mean, he do does seem kind of sleazy, so actually, never mind. He could be a protagonist. Anyway, yes, he robbed a bank, so we're kind of in the middle of investigating that. That uh, being said, I don't entirely remember what I'm supposed to be doing. So let's see. Check memory card. Yep, 11%. All right. 11% of the way through. Oh, that's right. This isn't a control stick game. Just got to reacquaint myself with all the controls. Got to go outside. Let's see. I believe the triggers are run. Yep. Here we go. Alley. -oop. Gotta do that, of course. Let's just jump, of course. Okay, I got it. I got it. Now then. Time to figure out where to go. Let's see. Probably to police? I think we want to go past this and then go to the bank. Alright. 
which one of you can tell me what I was supposed to be doing? I kind of forgot. Spaced out for like a week. What am I doing? Oh, not the apartments. You know, the apartments. Look, if you can take a police car, you can take a big robot. That's just science. Everyone knows this. <laughs> you like robots, right? Well, how about destroying one? What if you destroyed one for us? Play with him to death. Alright, and cops are just delegating the uh, very dangerous big robot attacking the apartments to a child. I mean, granted, they're correct to do so. However, <laughs> it's incidental. Alright, hey, there's the big robot. <laughs> Check this out! Here I go! <laughs> oh, I can't show my dance moves when there's somebody else watching! I get nervous! Alright, Caramel Man. It's Caramel Dance Man. So that's an interesting day you've been having, huh? What? Why? Is there, is there something... Bacha? <laughs> I forget, is that the... Is that Midori? Earl Grey Racing Team. <laughs> bird Hotel! I want to go to the Bird Hotel! No! Uh, I guess it is a hotel for birds. Th these are not grounds that I can walk. Also, Midori Lee lives in Green Mansion. It's her mansion. <laughs> Belongs to her. Alright, we uh, greeted a door. Alright, All right, I guess I'll go to the apartment. I saved you from a big robot, so let's hang out. Alright. Well, that means I can just punch whatever I want. There's not much to do around here. I can't bother things like I can back in my own house. You don't complain nearly enough for my liking. You have not complained once. I have punched like everything in here. And you're just like, oh yeah, that's fine. Alright, you uh, lost a precious thing. Okay, well, I mean, that's all well and good, but okay, now we can check things. Mm -hmm. Alley. Alright, so let's see. Not in the fridge. You didn't put your precious thing in the fridge. Mm -hmm. Oh no, that's just your shadow. That's just your shadow. That's not important. <laughs> Did you lose this painting that's on your wall? It's here. <laughs> Did you misplace this painting? Alright, cool. Here's your painting back. <laughs> wow. Destroyed. 
<laughs> I mean, you're right, but... Um... Don't just yell that. She needs to find that out on her own. Oh no, pop quiz. I don't remember. <laughs> I forgot. Can I come back later? Alright, cool. This completely defeats the purpose of a pop quiz. <laughs> Alright, here's a pop quiz. Surprise! Except you can just go back to the source and look at the thing. I mean, this isn't even, like... This isn't even a test on, like, how well I've been taking notes. I don't have notes. You're just letting me go right to the source. Alright, so it's a cat. <laughs> I kind of figured every quiz would be like that. Still managed to screw the first one up, though. <laughs> Wasn't counting on the teacher desk. It was a fool. Okay, first answer, good. <laughs> Even if I had accidentally just pressed A too fast, would have been fine. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, then. And back we are. Let's not talk about this with you, Senbei. No. Get out. Get... No. <laughs> Don't be. <laughs> just, we're just gonna go to bed and never speak of this again, Senbei. I mean, is it? Is it Dr. Wily? Not Wily? Ashirito. You just had your robot do a dance for a lady. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna lie to you. It's definitely a raw leg. <laughs> there is absolutely no way <laughs> this is going to be understood correctly. You can write a formal challenge. There are no brain cells for them to realize that this is a challenge you're going to send. I mean, look, Arale will still come to wherever you say she should go to, but, you know, she's not going to think it's a fight. <laughs> just, just like, writing you a letter, letting you know, gonna destroy ya. I just thought that was a college phase, but no, he's still at it. <laughs> the idiot. <laughs> Freaking moron trying to take over the world. How's he gonna do that? What are you gonna do with the whole planet? You gonna delegate? There's so much delegation. It's not worth it. <laughs> what a maroon. Well, I mean, obviously. Otherwise, they're not going to send the postage correctly. Get 
thing. All right. Yeah, that kind of defies the laws of creation, Senbei. Can you use this to not prank? <laughs> Very good design. Also, hold on a sec, real quick. Just gonna... Let's see, uh, Twitch chat. Let me just decrease the font a bit. It's a little too big. You 40 will do it. Alright, anyway. Right. <laughs> so he did give me a button to use. There's no inventory. Alright, so... I'm sure when I can use it, it will tell me. Probably still don't have any new clothes to get, so... Guess I'll just go outside. I may have managed to completely miss where I'm supposed to go. Oh god, oh no, he's gone. <laughs> Alright, it's fine. There's only so many places I can go. And then I managed to get lost somehow. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, how's the translation? Uh, seems pretty solid. Uh, grammar's A-OK. -okay. Everything seems to be on point. Uh, as I've said before, I'm not... I don't know much about Dr. Slump, but I'm sure it is accurate with everything it's portraying. Let's see, uh... There's this senseless act of violence. I, I guess we at least can't punch our teacher, but we're not turning her back, so see you later. <laughs> mm. I guess that's just an Easter egg, unless I have to... Oh, that's right. Okay, yep, yep. Okay, good. I had to go to the hills. Yep, I knew this all along. Alright, is there anything else I can, uh, ruin for the next afternoon? No, nobody here. Alright, well, let's go to the secret lair then. can't just knock into it immediately. <laughs> Alright, just gonna nip this in the bud. 
your big robot's now just a normal sized pig thing. <laughs> Come on! It was gonna be a real cool fight! Please? <laughs> Alright, we'll humor you. Here's your big robot back. Alright, this time uh, I'm not gonna be uh, distracted by the text size of the chat. <laughs> Every robot for himself, see ya! <laughs> what are you gonna do about a door? Nothing, that's what! I mean, it is locked, isn't it? And this is not the key. The key is not spinning around. Can't rim into it either, which, I'm gonna be honest, doesn't feel like it's, uh, you know, realistic. I don't know. I think a Raleigh could knock over a locked door. Is it made of metal? I don't care. A Raleigh could still destroy it. She's too powerful. It's her entire thing. Powerful child. Alright, let's see. Well, I'm thinking then I should go elsewhere. Let's go to the hills. You around here? Caramel dance band. Alright, well, let's see where... Or let's see how Midori is doing. You alright, Midori? You're uh, still a monster here somewhere? Can I find you? Is that a thing I can do? Let's see. We probably don't need to find Midori, but like, there's an Easter egg where we can. <laughs> Just in the principal's office, like, I don't know how to deal with this. I'm a pig now. Hey, Principal, uh, are you wondering where Midori is? <laughs> she has returned to nature. Well, okay then. Uh, let's see. Alright. Oh, why did I go to the classroom? Ah oh, yes, the classroom, the exact same thing as outside. Alright, well, I guess we're just going back to the lab. Again. Oh no. Oh heck! <laughs> Whoop! <laughs> also, hey, yeah, you, you made the translation. I had completely forgotten to check the name of that, and I forgot. Hello, Hilltop. Thank you for translating this. I, I am enjoying this, and it is absolutely not possible for me to have played this without a translation, because there's a lot of going back and forth, which I never would have understood on my own. Uh, anyway, could not challenge uh, Caramel Man to a fight, Senbei. You realize this is your problem now, don't you? You fool! Ah, high jump, I see! <laughs> is this a charge jump? Okay, crouch and then release to perform a very high jump. Ah, yep. Think this is funny? Look at me! Ah. <laughs> oh no, Retroarch's dying cloud.
Alright, well, I guess we can't transform anything anymore. Oh well. Alright, so, crouch jump is a little awkward, but... Oh. There we go. Got a, got a character. Oh, wait. Oh, okay, so it's just holding crouch. Got it. Okay. <laughs> Stop doing that! Come on, I'm on the roof. Yeah, it's weird that this is a not oft used art style, because it does look great always. Like, this and Legends are some of the best looking, like, 3D graphics PS1 games. Just very good models and sprites. Alright, so we've got Frog Jump. Uh, what does that do for me? Oh, nice. I don't know if I've seen the Fist of the North Star PS1 game. Nah, that's probably why it's also untranslated. I know, like, the NES one, which looks weird, and Lost Paradise, and that's about it. Alright, uh, so Senbei's just in the lab, so he's probably going to yell at me if I go down there. So let's see... Uh, I guess I'll just show off my cool new jump to everybody. Oh, you know, I can read the newspaper, probably. Can't quite get to the top of the coffee pot. Mm. Ah, it's something new. Ah, dang it. I wasn't expecting it to change. Well, then, I better, uh... <laughs> Go back to space. Uh, yeah, I was not expecting it to change, so we'll probably get new info then. Okonomi. Have you spoken with Mr. Time recently? I have. I've spoken spoken with a sapient clock. It's weird. <laughs> oh, cool. So you can just uh, grind in this game. I probably don't need to, but, you know, if you wanna. Ah, okay. I see. Yep, yep. I getcha. See, so, yeah, I just revisit old areas and uh, get the things he missed. That makes sense. I guess there were some things that were out of reach, weren't there? Probably could have used Frog Jump or other things. Alright, we'll just keep on checking areas. Uh, have you ever considered that I'd keep doing this because I'm too good at baseball? No one can catch that now, can they? Oh, it's catch. Well, maybe you're not putting in enough effort into this game of catch. Have you ever thought of that? Also, I never talk to the dad, but I also don't want to talk to the dad. <laughs> Alright, look. Robot stuff, not working out super well. But, like, now I'm on the roof. <laughs> Dramatic zoom. I'm going to embarrass you. You'll never get up here. <laughs> I'm about to humiliate. I'm, a, I'm gonna humiliate this girl. <laughs> this kicks ass! 
<laughs> oh man, if only we had some sort of new power we could use to defeat him. Also, that is a Paper Mario ass sprite you got there. Yoink! <laughs> well, damn! Hey, can I learn? No? Alright, see you later. All right. Uh, yep. And one more time, secret lair. All right, so let's see what's up. Is this going to be another action stage? Are we at that point yet? Oh no! <laughs> We've been fooled. <laughs> I've changed the locks! You'll never get in! <laughs> That's literally it! <laughs> I can be fun just inside a locked house! <laughs> Home security isn't a joke, Arale. Alright, well... I wonder if Senbei has any sort of key shape changing machine. Uh, really, I think that just the biggest thing that I want from this game that's not here is just like a map screen instead of just the options. Let you get in each area. Because for the amount of backtracking in this game, just having the kind of disconnected areas is a little awkward at times. But, you know, I've played Phoenix Wright games. Sometimes that just happens. I have dealt with this issue before. Oh, well, it's a good thing she's a pig now. He'll never find her. <laughs> Alright, Arale, I need you to understand. <laughs> These are lives we're playing with. Do not take this lightly. Alright, so... Onward we go. Uh, let's see, this one is police. And I think I can just go to the apartments from there. There we go. Alright, any giant robots in there? You're back to normal. <laughs> Raleigh, you turned me into a monster. All right, what was that? I'm on the side in front of this police station. I mean, pig's not an option, so I gotta go check real quick. Take a good look at it, and never come back, please. Alright, let's see... Oh, hey, how's it going? There's actually a reason to come here. <laughs> I'm going to dance at the cops until, until they tell me what I want to know. <laughs> oh, 
we're gonna have a boss fight. <laughs> ah, good. Super punch. You fool. You utter imbecile. Okay, so this is rapid tap then, not hold. <laughs> I know further violence. Ah, oh, let me do it, come on. <laughs> Alright, I can do that. I forgot about that move. Holy hell, I'm shook to my very core! <laughs> Goodbye! She sounds very Kirby-ish when she does that punch. Alright, so let's see. Ow, you... Okay, yeah, it's, it's just it's just a penguin. It's just, you're less likely to see that. Because, you know, you, you can't jump up that high until about now. So, you know, you're probably going to need to uh, check back there to see the quiz. But I wonder if you can just, like, sequence break that. I don't think they would let you miss out on a move permanently or anything, so... Wonder if it just forces you to go back at some point. All right, so let's see, penguin. <laughs> I mean, yeah. All right, cool. Well, that's all we needed to do around here. Now, let's leave, because there's nothing else we gotta do. Eh, well, uh... Is Caramel Man back at the uh, police station, or...? Let's see where he is. Nope, doesn't look like it. Alright, well, mission accomplished. Let's go home. Alright, don't worry, Senbei. Uh, I have gotten Midori to forgive me. It's fine. So, let's see, school time. Now, there is a lot of open area here. Is this gonna be the boss fight? <laughs> Can't go back to school unless you defeat me! Oh, minefield, huh? <laughs> Ah, I see. You've made the area super gross, so you assume <laughs> that nobody's going to get close to you. However, I'm going to keep doing it. <laughs> this backfired on you, huh? <laughs> just just going to start begging me to stop. This is so gross. <laughs> and once again, I leave the planet.
<laughs> Alright, on second thought, I'm actually going to save the world from a Raleigh! Alright, another challenge. Oh no. <laughs> nope, not telling this one to kids. Alright, don't worry, I'm sure it won't work. Um, I don't like how that sentence went. Oh well, whatever. Let's just go outside. in class and he's trying to learn. <laughs> Gonna get better grades than a Raleigh. <laughs> it sure did, Midori. <laughs> it sure did. Alright, well then, what are you up to? She's like a cat at that Akane. <laughs> you gotta stop saying these things with a teacher in the room. <laughs> I mean, I couldn't tell you either way. I don't see the lessons. I mean, let's see. Let's see what it is. Actually, I want to talk to y'all first. Alright, well, they're just very adamant about me picking a thing up. Where's the shiny thing? Oh, there it is. I saw it shine. There it is. Shiny acquired. Or spotted. Still not getting it quite. I see the shiny. I know it's here. Oh, wait a minute. I had to, uh, that's right. Yep. <laughs> I forgot. You gotta crouch to get things. One hundred yen isn't a lot of money. Why? <laughs> no way! What do the cops need this money for? It's a hundred yen! Look, if somebody really misses this hundred yen, they can just talk to me about it. Otherwise, fucking not giving it to the cops. <laughs> I am being a good citizen. Being the best citizen. Can't stop me. Look at me being a good citizen. Alright, well then. 
living room it is. I mean, at this point, that's kind of just where I'm gravitating towards anyway. It's a good meeting spot. It's where Senbei tells me where I need to go. Is it called the mail system? Oh, it's a man. <laughs> the Rob bot. <laughs> He's just a little man. Can you tell me about this plan? Okay, this is sounding bad. She's going to scream, Senbei! <laughs> no. None of that's going to happen. Oh, okay. Well, I mean... <laughs> I'd say you do you, but, like, this is not great. <laughs> All intelligence, no wisdom. That's his build. <laughs> <laughs> I've got the medium, but I don't have the message. Damn it! <laughs> oh, you know. You just keep getting these anymore. Alright, yep. Final challenge. Definitely. All right. <laughs> look at him. Look at the robot. He's just down there now. It's just, there's just a robot down there. I love him. All right. So, uh, gonna go outside then. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just love his very neutral face. <laughs> just hanging out. <sighs> Alright, let's go to the secret lair. Alright, let's open this door and get on that floor. Clatter. <laughs> That's me saying that. Ah, I gotta complete an action stage. There we go. Alright, action stage time then. Yeah, I kind of figured it'd be all just like, uh, time traveling, but nope. That's just the intro to them. Oh, that didn't work out at all. Kind of figured I could punch that, but nope. That was a bad idea. Also, dang, this is a really nice looking stage. Prehistoric area looked nice, but mm, this is just real pretty. Also, there's no uh, collection gimmick this time around. It's just a nice, uh, really good. Uh, God, I, in general, I like water areas, but this area is just very pretty. Oh, God, fish. <laughs> Nope. This time, that one. Yeah. Okay, this one's dropping grenades. 
Grenades don't really have a very big explosion radius, though. Oh, nice. I can just come down here to this, uh, nice little cabin. This is pleasant. I'm really digging this one. Alright, so, can't enter the cabin, it's just, it's just here! It's just here to be a nice little set piece. That's fine. Oh. Is some poop to poke, though. There we go. I don't know, I'm, I'm definitely digging this one. It's a cool action stage. I'm glad there aren't any sort of, uh, time limits or anything during the action stages. This is real pretty. Oh, <laughs> there's just a uh, welcome door right there. Ah, now we're in ruins. This is fine, I suppose. <laughs> Still okay looking ruins, but I'm, I'm very fond of the outside area. Oh, hello, ghost. Okay, so you take a while to float down, so I can just go past you like that. I feel like I'm going backwards. Mm -hmm. Aha! I knew it! <laughs> I knew it was all a ploy to fall on me. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> Exit, and also traps. Well, thank you for telling me. Whoop. But touching the sides can hurt you, too. Getting out of the way of that. Aha! Thought you could hide from me. Thought you could hide with danger, but nay, you cannot. out of the way. Very easy to fool ghosts. Oh, I seem to be back in the general entry area. Oh, no, nope, that is just coincidentally uh, an area with two rollers. Not the same as the entrance. Impossible! ran right into you. You float too much to be a threat, friend. God, I love that just Yoshi's Island ass sound effect. Uh, so I will say, I'm liking both aspects of this game. Like, the sort of, I guess, exploring portions are, you know, a little bit heavy on backtracking. As I said earlier, definitely could not play this game untranslated. Would not be able to do it. There's just too much backtracking for it. Nope. Oh. Oops. Ah, now you're actually just moving around. But yeah, even then it's kind of just, you know, nice and chill. You just go around talking to people. Even if you're going back and forth, it's charming enough. I'm digging the town. And the characters in it. I don't know if this is like the best introduction for Dr. Slump, but I'm enjoying it. I'm guessing people who've actually experienced the series are probably like, Ah, dang! Love seeing these characters. Oh! <laughs> but the action stages have also been good. The prehistoric one was okay. But I'm liking this one. I especially like the intro bit. I, I can't say that enough. That just looks real pretty. At the moment, I do, however, seem to be lost in the maze. I think... I think by now I've actually, uh... 
moved back around, haven't I? This looks vaguely familiar. No, yeah, I'm pretty sure I've been here. Okay, so I... There's a direction here that... Uh, I think there was a direction I didn't take at one point, and I've accidentally looped around. Oh, there we go. This is definitely new. You know, I don't even mind the 97 anime designs that much. Some of them, anyway. Like, I kind of like Akane's design, but also, like, in this version, she does not look like she should be in Arail's class. She looks like she should be in Taro's class. Bisuke is just slightly taller. I also think Arale looks fine in the 97 anime. Though, I, I guess if you're used to- Oh god! Hello! <laughs> Hello, big crab! Very threatening aura. I guess, I guess the biggest thing is, like, this is the kind of anime where, like, you know, it ran for, a, or, like, the manga and the anime ran for a while. You know, it's something that you kind of just get used to, right? Like, here's this series by Toriyama that I really like. It's not exactly a slice of life from what I understand. You know, there, there are storylines in it, but it's one of those cozy mangas, so changing character designs just all of a sudden could be kind of jarring. Yeah, you, you get used to your your usual Dr. Slump designs, and then they change, and it's like, what the heck? But again, that's just coming from somebody who's not used to either, so... That's just my guess. Get that old Raleigh juice. Oh, that was actually the way forward. Oh, this looks cool. We got some jungle going on. Jungle maze. Just getting deeper into the ruins. It's very Etrian Odyssey. Just, I don't need that. Just, uh, we changed stratums. Didn't even have to fight a tough boss for it. Hopefully this is also not like Etrian Odyssey 1 and we don't just have to randomly commit genocide in the middle of it. Etrian Odyssey 1 was a very weird game. I don't think they fully considered the ramifications of, like, half the stuff that happens in that plot, and the fact that you get to make your own party. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, God. <laughs> They're ready to do the crab rave when they defeat me. I'm prepared for it. Oh, no. Yoink. Alright, good. I defeated them. Almost uh, maxed out the old happiness meter. Or pep gauge, rather. Kind of figured. Cam, please. There we go. And now I have. Maybe. It looks like it backed off slightly, but it's flashing now, so. I can only assume it's fine. So let's see, where have I not been? I think there are rollers up here, so... I'd best be careful. Um... I'm going to be optimistic and say I'm not going to be coming back that way, so... Oh, camera. Thank you. I will not get lost. I will not go back in that direction. It definitely won't happen. Uh, not the worst maze I've ever experienced, although... 
I did like the linearity of the first part. Oh, there's just an arrow right here pointing me at where I need to go. How handy. But yeah, I did kind of like the linearity of the first part. But this is not the worst maze I've ever experienced. Ah, uh, now you're just free-moving ghosts. You're not bound by the paths of your brethren. Not just stuck being a weird wall. Oh, hello. You're the most dangerous one. <laughs> oh, no. The danger orbs. I probably can't punch them when they're like that. Oh, but they... Like, the ghosts can only move from side to side. Okay. I just have to find a better way of tricking them out. Because they actually fall at a normal rate. You don't even really hurt me, do you? You just blocked my way. Because I would have taken damage otherwise. Alright. Get that Arale juice. Oh. Uh, also... The combat in this game is slightly weird, because uh, I'm playing an N64 game right now that kind of feels like it controls a bit similar to this, uh, but you get an air attack in that game. And so it's weird not having an air attack in this game. I cannot sky punch. <laughs> Arale, you've seen this robot! my hair, it's fine, it's not graying. I'm a young scientist. You can't! Alright, so this one's immune to attacks. So I probably can't just slide, right? <laughs> Alright, so not as easy as the first boss, because I can't just slide into him. Oh! So let's see, what can I do? Well, I can get him walking forever. Okay. Full punch doesn't do anything. What if I left on you? Boing. Nope, that didn't work. Alright, uh, let's see, what have I not tried yet? Do I have to collide with your punch? Okay, you can just r run into me. Gotcha. Cool. Okay, that is your most powerful attack. I will admit. What else can he do? Alright, so Caramel Man's kind of got a uh, similar move set to me. He can punch and he can run. It's a Platinum Games boss fight. This game's usually pretty lenient about saves, so... Hmm. <laughs> Should be fine, right? It'll just put me at the boss. Yep, I kinda figured. Now, did he react to that first slide because that's what I'm supposed to do, or because that was the first attack I did? 
what I felt. Yeah, I felt nothing from that. Okay, he's not reacting anymore. Oh, what if I, though... Hmm. Ah. Sooner. Ah, oh, dang it. He's just got the better run. Okay, if he does something, can I... No. Can I trip him up while he's doing something? I feel like it would have to... Oh. I feel like it would have to be the wind-up punch, right? This is what I got before the boss. It makes sense that this is what I need. See, my timing is terrible on this dash attack. Winding up way too long there. Hmm, alright, so let's see. So yeah, the first punch he always mentions that he didn't feel anything. Not done anything else to prompt any new text. Uh, what might I have gotten? Uh oh. <laughs> Can I trip him? That's a punch. Come on. Run again. Nope. did nothing for me. So let's see. Uh -oh. <laughs> it's actually kind of tricky to dodge. Oh. Ah, oh, dang, he actually got a rally to fall over. Dang. So powerful. Let's see. Hmm. Slide, feels nothing. Yeah, that doesn't do anything. Okay, so interrupting him there doesn't do anything. And as I said before, I don't have an air attack, so I can't hit him. Can I make him dizzy? I don't really have enough time to really do anything when I'm behind him either. Kind of at a loss for what to do. I don't think I, don't, I have any other moves that I haven't used. Yeah, I can't cross counter, unfortunately. Alright, this is the second boss, so there must be something obvious I'm missing, right? in the arena either, so oh, not like it's an environmental detail I'm missing. Yeah, I still can't stop him from running.
so I don't think I'm able to do the, uh, like, Earthbreaker thing that Raleigh's done, like, twice now. That she learned from, a uh, Superman. Because I don't remember getting an actual new move for that. Jumping over didn't do anything. Getting run into didn't do anything. doesn't seem to do anything. If anything would happen from time, it would have happened by now, probably. on this one. I don't think I missed any moves, did I? Hmm. I don't think they would let you just go through an entire action stage if you didn't have all the tools you needed. It would be weird if they did. Yeah, no, nothing. I kind of have to figure this one out. He felt nothing from that. I just haven't been getting the, uh... No? I'm pretty sure that's the maximum punch I can do. Have I learned anything else? I've got frog jump, I've got the big punch. Um You can backseat uh if uh if I'm just like if I'm forgetting a move, I kinda wanna figure it out myself, but otherwise if it if it's involves stuff I've almost been doing, then yeah, go for it. But I, I don't think it's all I've gotten is the big jump and better punch. So yeah, go for it.
Oh, so it is the Earth Splitter. The prob- Okay, so the problem is I don't remember how to do the Earth Splitter. I thought that was just a thing. Okay, um... Alright, well... Alright, you know... You know what would remember how to do the Earth Splitter, though? The last VOD, so... Let me just... Just give me a minute. Just look through uh, the last VOD and remember the button combination for that, because I don't remember. I have not done that move since I got it. So let's see. And thankfully it should be easy to find, because I just gotta find old Supper Man. Old Puma Man. Alright, capture the Earth Splitter ability, press and hold the... Oh, so it's... Oh, so that's why the uh, better punch is Rapid Tap, because it's press and hold. Oh, <laughs> I tried to use the control stick. That's right. Get out of the way, you okay? Yeah, this is tricky, cause like, <laughs> yeah, I completely forgot, cause like, wow, I am so slow on the draw. There we go. So yeah, uh, there really isn't any animation for it unless you're committing to it. So that's the big thing I was having a problem with. I forgot Earth Splitter was an actual move. I thought it was just something where all I kind of did in cutscenes and I didn't really have any control for. No. <laughs> Get out of here. Uh oh <laughs> Started running immediately. I did not see that one coming. Alright, so yeah, this is now a very easy boss, because all I gotta do is just charge when he's not nearby. Okay, so yeah, he's just running any time. Alright, well... Oh, jeez! <laughs> he's got a super move! <laughs> All right, one more hit. I'm sure we'll do a super move one more time. Oop. Now he's just gonna run. And slide it. <laughs> killed all right yep definitely save because I've not saved at all tonight yep overwrite that please and I just, I just want to check 19% dang eight whole percents all right anyway though we shall continue The weird version of Crazy Diamond. <laughs> no, my leash. No, that one doesn't work. <laughs> we have taken over planet Italy already. You walking here? You walking? You walking on the Italians? Mm 
<laughs> this is so dumb. <laughs> I do not know what the English actually sound like. I guess we've got an alien abduction on our way, but first, I got I got full pep. Oh, don't worry, you never will. Uh, I mean, stopped hiding was a good first sentence. This part of it is less good. Does she even know you, Senbei, outside of just, like, dropping a Raleigh off? Wait. Alright, um... So, am I going to get smokes and never come back? Is that it? Doing a bit of role reversal here? Alright, sure. Uh, well, before we do that, uh, I would like my new thing. Give me my thing. No, I want my thing! I want the thing. Give me the thing. Uh, every time I actually have a full pep meter, he just doesn't want to talk. Yeah, no, he's not gonna spawn here, I guess, until I get his smokes. Well, I guess Araleigh has to come back. Alright, well, let's just go to the empty lots. Several Yakuza members are fighting off in the distance. John just makes noises. It's all we expect from him. <laughs> ah, dang. Turned it around. You're the boring one. Oh man, she's saying we have no style and no grace. I guess it's our clothes that are a disgrace. I mean, maybe if we got a different outfit. Oh, we could go to his house. But instead of doing that, what if I just went back to the lab and got my new thing? I want my new thing. I know you want your smokes, but I want my thing. Have you spawned down here yet? Yes, you have. All right, what you got for me? <laughs> oh! Hmm... All right, so let's see... I'm actually curious. This one I might use. By which I mean I'm using it right now. Okay, so, well, I mean, I've got to look at all of them. So let's see, darkish. Oh, good, it actually flips between them very quickly. Greenish. Bluish. Yellowish. That's not quite as aqua as I was hoping for. That's a pleasant purple. I think I like this purple. Alright, well then. Can I be hip? Do I have clothes to be hip yet? Nope, I don't. Good grief and alas. Oh well. 
So let's see. Back to the empty lots. And... Ez house. A mysterious house. I mean, every house is a mysterious house when you don't live in it. Oh, this guy, yeah. Hey, Superman. Nope, not me. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. <laughs> Look, you're gonna have to break this facade for a Raleigh. She already knows who you are, you just have to accept it. Alright, well, we've got this location then. Well, who's Kanoko? Should go to the smoke shop, but who's Kanoko? Kanoko is not here right now. Oh, is that the uh, fashionable lady? She's too hip for us. Yeah, nothing here we can really do unless I can punch a tree. Nope, I phased through them as always. I can go in the well though. Important discovery. Tis a well. All right, gotta go to the smoke shop then. Let's get Senbei's smokes. Let me just mess with everyone else first. Nope, nothing. Okay. <laughs> hey, give me some smokes. I mean, this is her best opportunity. What if we destroyed the Earth? Aha! No. Alright, well... If Earthshaker doesn't get her up, then I don't know what will. Yeah, she's still sleeping. I mean, w really, we should just take them at this point. Come on, Arale. Oh. <laughs> Alright, you got me, old lady. <laughs> no, you, you can't just do that. <laughs> you can't just say it's for somebody else when you buy alcohol or cigarettes. That doesn't fly. You can't just do that! Oh, uh, well. I mean, works for us, I guess. <laughs> hey, I've got Sigs. Am I cool now? <laughs> yeah, I pick up 100 yen coins. I get smokes underaged. What about it? <laughs> okay, okay, this is... nope. <laughs> Don't actually like playing <laughs> using these things. Okay, so yeah, that, that's Kanoko. Alright, well, I guess this taught us an important lesson. Smoking might look extremely cool, but don't do it, because it's gross. What? Oh, okay, I guess this isn't a later thing. I mean, look, I, I thought I was going to give Senbei smokes, but now we're just doing this. Mm. 
what? Hi. All of Morale's catchphrases are good. How dare you? Well, I've already been in the well once, so... Alright, my big mistake was entering the well and not crouching. Check this move out. Oh, I didn't even need to crouch for that one. Oh, sure, now that I remember it. Uh, how is your underwear doing this? <laughs> how and why? <laughs> Don't worry, there's nobody around here. It's fine. We can say underwear. Cops aren't around to catch us. Alright, congratulations. You have fixed my... Just absolutely befuddling laundry mistakes. Hmm, the palm tree. But palm trees don't even exist. How can I how can I get it? If the palm tree does not in fact exist. See, I missed. I phased through it. Oh wait a minute, I'm guessing that's uh Yep, destroy the earth. And knock it down. See, see, now I know. Now I know to use the earth splitter. I'm not going to forget it now, probably. Maybe. Now that they're actually making me use it. That is literally the exact opposite of thing that I told you to do. Alright, well then. I guess that's that. Well, Arale's cool now. That's all we needed after th out of this whole event. Arale's cool and with it. And now we don't have the smokes anymore, but whatever, it's fine. Oh! Well, look at that! <laughs> Here I go! It's the other reason this game doesn't have a map is, you know, sometimes you do have to hit those, uh, very specific areas. Again, like Phoenix Wright, certain areas are connected in weird ways because they're kind of trying to shuffle you from one specific point to a different specific point. <laughs> oh man, he's gonna he's gonna do a thing. <laughs> hmm, a real stumper this one. Oh, dang. <laughs> Close one. <laughs> what amazing intelligence. It's, it's terrifying. <laughs> ah, the little girl knows that knowledge is power. We sure proved our point. <laughs> no, she just does that, it's fine. <laughs> oh no! 
<laughs> the ship wasn't made to stand up to hijinks! Look out, you're gonna crash! Ah! Well, I hope you've learned your lesson. Everybody about the aliens. Yeah, no, we're gonna we're gonna mention aliens. All right, see you later. <laughs> Just gonna blow up your entire spot. Hey, Pummelman. Ah, you got nothing to say. Hey, Kanoko. Aliens. <laughs> Alright, well then. So far, no good. Alright, you know who I'm sure is going to care a lot about this? The old lady at the smoke shop. Alright, yep, you know. She was sleeping, but I figure she cares a lot about what I had to say. Alright, so we're going home, but like, what if I then decided, hey, I'm gonna go to the coffee pot. Gonna go to the coffee pot and I talk to some people. Wait, 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 wait. Dumplings. Alright, see? Now I know. You cannot fool me. I already know the special. Well, it's dumplings. Uh -huh. Yeah, I kind of figured. Oh, really? Hmm. How wonderful are we talking about? Is it going to be worth going after all of them? Ah, no, I already took care of the robot newspaper. You're old news. <laughs> Hell yeah, I get to see some aliens! Alright, let's just bring the whole crew. Come on. Yeah, no worries. Let's get the whole squad in on this. <laughs> They're just like a big face. You, you know Kirby? What if Kirby was just real weird looking? Just like real weird. That's these aliens. All right, now to tell the school faculty about this. <laughs> hey, principal, guess what? I bet you haven't even talked to a dinosaur yet, Arale. Come on. Quit pulling my leg. Alright. Oh, good. I don't have to go back to your apartment.
Oh, don't worry, I already told the principal. It's true, and I already told them. Told them. Uh, well, I mean, one of them was yellow, but the first one was green. See, I remember this one. Wait, what? <laughs> you already know? But how? <laughs> that doesn't answer my question! Alright, well then, that's ominous. Alright, I think that's everyone I care about, told. Yeah, I don't care about Taro's dad. Don't care about... Oh, uh... Yeah, I can't get to... Hmm... Can I go to the evil lair? That's no longer secret, because we know where it is. Ah, I was hoping we could tell Caramel Man about this. Oh well. Sure, Cal Caramel Man would love to see aliens. That seems like his thing. He does spend a lot of time in space. All right. Uh, I guess we'll just go home. Let's see. Can I access anything from Chapter Two? Uh, nope. Alright, all that stuff actually disappeared. Now that we no longer need it, we can't go to those places. That's good to know. Kind of makes things easier anyway, so it's probably for the best. Alright, well then, in that case, uh... Guess we'll go to the lab. Tell Senbei about it. Oh, wait a minute. No, this is the wrong Senbei. We gotta go to the living room. Oh, no, I guess that was the correct senbei. Oh, alright. <laughs> come back when you fill filled your pep gauge or you've gotten me my smokes. Either or, come on. I need my smokes. Uh, that being said, though, uh, it's 1046. I feel like... If I keep going, I'm just going to be here for a while. But it is unfortunately wrap-up time, so... I'm thinking I'm going to go back to Arale's room. And finish up for the night. So that was fun. I think I'm getting a hang of this game a bit more. Kind of... I mean, I mean, especially now that I've actually remembered Earth Splitter exists and I'm using it. Now that I'm act now that I know all of my moves, I think I'm in a better position, uh, which is good. Cause yeah, that that boss kind of gave me trouble. Cause the one move I did not remember is the one <laughs> I absolutely needed. Uh, but that is on me. I learned a thing at the end of last session and just did not commit it to memory well enough. And they never asked me about it again until that boss. Oh well. Anyway, though, got the hang of that, had a good action stage, which, despite being a maze, was actually pretty fun. I enjoyed myself in that one. And now we have the aliens, who might be my favorite characters thus far. Apparently, their dumb, dumb jokes are just my brand of humor. Uh, but yeah, I guess that'll be it for this week's stream of Dr. Slump. Uh, next week, I'll be continuing on with Chapter 3, probably a little bit of Chapter 4, uh, you know, I usually do like a chapter and a quarter every night, it seems. It seems to be where this is headed. But yeah, that'll be next Saturday, 9 to 11 p.m. Eastern Time. Tuesday, 5 to 7 p.m. Eastern will be the Hades stream. And Thursday, 5 to 7, will be the JoJo's Bizarre Adventure 7th Stand user stream. I'm sort of getting close to the end of that, but I looked at the extras I had to do, or I want to do, and, oh boy, <laughs> I think that one still has legs, despite what I thought. Oh well, regardless though, don't have to think about that right now. Uh, and other plugs, uh... You can check out uh, Fefner Moss Mayonnaise on YouTube. 
if you want to check out these VODs, if you're not already watching them. Or you can just look up my LPs, they're also on there. Got uh, Sonic Advance Wednesday, that's actually kind of ending next week, it'll have one bonus part. Uh, Mega Man 7 on Monday, and Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga on Friday. That's all the normal plugs, so also, hey, if you like tabletop, you can always go to uh, twitch.tv slash battlesk on Wednesdays at 8.30 or 9 p.m. Eastern Time. We'll probably play Lancer this week. Didn't last week, because everybody was exhausted. Two of us were exhausted by the light of the sun being cruel, but, you know. <laughs> Other than that, we'll probably be fine for next week. Uh, although, I also, like, Battlesk is the highest priority, uh... Uh, auto host on here so if you hang out on this channel at 8 30 or 9 p.m. you'll probably see it anyway so there's that anyway though I think that's about it I don't think I have anything else to mention so yeah uh, that's uh I think that'll do it for this stream uh thank me thanks for uh joining me y'all and I will see you later have a good night